Hi, I'm Ben Gaines from Adobe Analytics Product Management. Analysis Workspace is the newest member of Adobe Analytics. It's designed to be a flexible, freeform environment where you can explore data and relationships within data uh, and create really any uh, project around data that will answer your unique questions and help you drive your business with analytics. I want to give you a very quick overview of Analysis Workspace in this video and invite you to watch the dozens of other videos we've created diving into specific aspects of this exciting new tool. So here I am in Analysis Workspace. Um, the first thing that you'll notice when you work with Analysis Workspace is that it's everything's drag and drop. Uh, you, can, you can place any dimension, metric, segment, time range just about anywhere and this means you can do unlimited breakdowns and comparisons so I'm looking at a product name report and uh, I can drag a new metric over and replace the existing metric and I can drag a different metric over and put it next to the one that I had previously placed there then I can do as many breakdowns as I want to so if I want to see for example this Norfolk Highland product and I want to see what terms people search for on my site at the same time that they bought that product, I can do that here and I can see um, how those different search terms led people to purchase that product uh, if, if they did at all. I can even go one step further. If I want to see for people who searched on the, uh, class, on the keyword classic and then bought Norfolk Highland, how did they originally find my site? So I can type in here and I can look at the marketing channels that brought those individuals to my site and you can see uh, I don't have a ton of data but paid search is uh, is my top channel and I can go as far into this as I want to I can also mix and match uh, breakdowns and comparisons so I could if I want to uh, say compare these metrics and these breakdowns across a couple of different segments um, I can select those segments in my uh, left rail and I can place them under the metrics and very very quickly um, I will be able to compare my weekend adventurers and my outdoor fashionistas right here in one table. That's great, but of course you want to be able to visualize that data as well. So we've built in a number of visualizations that you can use here uh, to review your data. Um, I'm going to add a simple bar chart here, uh, and I've, I've got a bunch of options in here to control that visualization uh, and, and review the data how I want to. I can even select rows in my table if I want to visualize just certain rows of data rather than visualizing the entire uh, the entire uh, project that I've got and all of this is very flexible I can resize these and add um, add other visualizations in addition um, so I could I could put a number in here and look at say the total number of orders for the Norfolk Highland uh, product um, and uh, and uh, have that be uh, resizable, reshapable, do anything I want to um, with that in here as well. So I've got very diverse layout options. This is really more of an application than a website. It has rich keyboard shortcuts and right-click functionality where I can uh, use, I can interact with the data, use my mouse exactly the way that I would in a desktop application or, or any other application. Uh, so there's there's quite a bit of power in there um, as well. Once I've created a project that's of interest to me, a key piece of Analysis Workspace is the ability to curate that project. Sometimes we have people that we work with who want to use data to do their jobs, but they're overwhelmed by the amount of data that's available. How, how is someone supposed to know uh, what, uh, what dimensions, metrics, and segments are right for them to use? Curation makes it possible for you to kind of provide that instruction. So if I were to share this with my merchandising team, I might add some product-related dimensions. And this will uh, allow the, uh, that team to use those dimensions anywhere in this project. They'll have all the flexibility that I've, uh, that I've provided for them here, uh, but they will be limited to the dimensions, metrics, and segments, and, and time ranges that are relevant in this project for that role. And so then I can share this out And when that team logs in to Adobe Analytics, they'll be able to come into Analysis Workspace and explore this project and play around with it. 
Analysis Workspace is also designed to be the fastest uh, analysis experience that we have uh, that we've that we've ever had. The the query times, the ability to retrieve data um, very very quickly is a big part of the power of this workspace. We're going to continue to invest and to develop Analysis Workspace, adding new tools all the time uh, to allow you to, to view data in new and exciting ways um, that, are, that, that really will help you, uh, a, as I said, drive your business with data and with, with Analysis Workspace. So continue to check back here, um, and hopefully um, this can become a, uh, an invaluable tool in your analysis arsenal.